In this video, I will build from scratch this module that I showed in the last video. It is automation for the X, Facebook, Instagram and YouTube. For TikTok, I will do a separated video because it is more complicated than other social media platforms because it is not built in. I will not include Blueprint, but if you're interested in having Blueprint, then you can email me. Email is under the video. So let's start by creating a new scenario. First, we need a location for our content. My content is in OneDrive. As OneDrive has five gigabytes free and is very easy to connect. First, I'm adding watch files in the folder and making connection. Click add, write a connection name. It will take me to another window where I can connect. Then I'm choosing my files from my drive location. I'm leaving basically everything the same. And then I'm choosing the folder where is my content located. What I'm changing is limit the maximum number that this module will work with. For example, if I want to upload at one time one video or one photo, I will change it to one. And I'm choosing all. Save. Second module that I'm adding is also in OneDrive and it is download a file module. Here I also need to connect. If your connection is done properly before, you can just choose it or it will be automatically added. And here I'm changing enable to enter a drive ID to yes, because I want to enter ID from previous module. You can search for drive ID. And for file ID, I will choose also from the previous module, this time item ID. Everything else stays the same. So now we have a location where our files are. The first module watches if something new is added and reacts to it. And the second one makes it possible to don download. For that content, we need title and description. And this can be done with AI and without AI. If you're doing it without AI, then just rename content properly. For example, if you have video, then rename it as what you want to be on the social media. Easier it is to use AI. For example, I am going to use in this module XAI, which is very cheap. If you're posting once a day, then it will be enough for you to use two euros for a couple of months. Great competition. And here you have to choose what module you're using. I'm using latest croc text module. And here you need to add message. First one I'm adding is user, although it can be a system. Let's use system. And now what I'm gonna do is input file name. So now I'm adding second message. And in second message, I'm asking AI based on the input from a file name it get to create a title. Also, I'm asking it to exclude everything I don't want to. For example, my videos have .mp4 at the end, so I don't want to, this to be in the title, so I'm asking AI to ex exclude it. And third thing I'm asking AI to do is to output only title that is under 100 characters. It is because YouTube is letting you maximum title to be 100 characters. Max tokens I'm keeping the same because AI will never use uh, so much tokens for the title. Click save. What I like to add next is router. It's here in the right menu. You don't have to add router. You can build everything in a row, but it's easier to fix problems or turn on and off social media platforms that you want or you don't like or that are not working. So I'm adding router. And the first social media that I'm adding is X, formerly Twitter. Here you can see or search for it. And to upload media on X, it has to be made out of two modules. First one has to be older version. Here in the top right corner, you can change it to version 5. And it must be upload media. Make sure you have right connection. In this video, I'm not doing connections. 
But if you have a problem with some connection, then let me know and I can make a video how to make them properly. Here you have to choose are you uploading images or videos and here you can do mapping. As you can see, it's done already automatically, but you can see it takes file name and data from the second module. Let's keep it on the first one. Click save. And now what you can do is add new module. Also X, formerly Twitter. Make sure you switch back to the newer version, which is version six and click create post. And make sure that connection is same that is in the previous module. And what you need to do here is click on mapping as text content. It can be result from the XAI, which is AI generated title. And for media ID, that's why you needed the first module. You need to take media ID from the module before X. Everything else can stay same. Save. And now it is uploading to X. Now let's move to another social media platforms to Facebook. Let's search for Facebook. You have to choose Facebook pages and here you can choose create a post with photos if you have photos, but I am doing videos. So I'm choosing upload a video. Make sure you have right connection with Facebook, choose the right page. And here it is upload a video. As you can see, mapping is one more time done automatically. This is good. And in description, use results from the XAI and click save. And now let's take Instagram. I add Facebook and Instagram to the same row as they are connected with each other. Here you have to choose Instagram for business with Facebook login. And as I'm uploading videos, I want them to be reels. So create a real post. Make sure you have right connection. And then here you need to input video URL. You can write here URL and have to choose download URL from the first module. Scroll down and here you have caption. This is result from the XAI and everything else you can leave empty. If you have location, then make sure you search for the right one and then you can paste it also here. I don't have, so save. And the next social media is YouTube. Add a module. Let's write YouTube. And in YouTube, you can see videos and upload video. Let's connect it to the main scenario. Make a YouTube connection title from the XAI. As again, mapping is done. Choose video category. For example, I have entertainment. Privacy is public. For description, you can add another AI before YouTube. For example, if you want to generate something or you can write yourself something like subscribe. If you want to have on other social media platforms longer titles, then you can do it by removing this 100 characters requirement from here and just adding another AI before YouTube that shortens it. Click save. If you're running sometimes a problem, you can ask AI in make to help you. Sometimes it does help. You can ask questions. It helps. You can even ask it to change the module, but be careful. Sometimes it messes everything up. So I recommend before asking AI for help, make sure you have saved so you can go back to the previous version. Now I have all the social media platforms I have. I am adding one safety module, which is sleep. It is delay, let's say for 60 seconds, we click save. And now when everything is done, this automation is delayed for 60 seconds before it moves to the next one, which is cleaning and deleting content we already have. For this, I have to go to the OneDrive because my file originates from the OneDrive. Let's write delete, delete file from the folder. Make sure that you have same connection as in the beginning. You have to keep everything same and only have to add file ID, which is item ID from the first module. So overall file is entering automations here. AI generates it text content and then it upload is uploaded to different social media platforms. And here, just in case to give automation some time, one minute or two minutes to peacefully upload everywhere, it deletes this file. 
so there is no mess on the drive. Especially it's good with AI created content. Rename it and save it. And here on the clock, you can add interval when content is posted. For example, if you want once a day, then you add 1440 minutes, which is every one day as it says now here, and then you activate scenario and click save one more time. So this is the automation from the scratch. If you need help with some connections, then let me know. I will make a separate video on them. Also, I will make a separate video how to use XAI and how to connect to it. And probably should do one on ChatGPT as ChatGPT is pretty helpful with other tasks. And as I said in the beginning, if you need blueprint or custom blueprint, then please write me an email and we will talk over there.